Hello everyone and hello again. Um so I tried to stream Starbound this morning and I couldn't, so well the server was really slow, so I couldn't really do anything. Instead of like sitting and waiting around to click, I thought let me just start a new round in Terraria online. So we'll see. So maybe I'll play Starbound and Terraria interchangeably on the weekends, we'll see how that goes. Well now though, I gotta build my house. And to be honest, I do enjoy the, the challenge of Terraria a little more than Starbound. You might be surprised to hear that because I'm always dying in Starbound, but hey, let's see how many times I'm gonna die in, in this playthrough. And starting is so weird because you don't have double jump. You don't have your wings, you don't have a decent pickaxe. It's pretty crazy. I did activate oh, so also basic I'm playing with the Thorium and Calamity and Alchemist NPC mod. So yeah, this will be fun. I've actually never finished Calamity. I got to the uh, last boss, which is the Eater of Worlds, I think the destroyer of worlds or whatever and yeah i just couldn't beat him <laughs> it was just insanely hard so yeah let's see if i can do it this time but yeah i'll also probably be playing with viewers if you guys want to join just let me know and yeah we'll join i won't have a server right because yeah i'm don't really like having servers because i don't know what what well, it's not like I don't know what I'm doing, but I don't know who I'm going with. I don't know how reliable they are, and like everyone you find, you can always find like bad things about them, and you can find people who are saying good things about them. So, we'll see how it goes. I'd like to make a straight world as much as I can. also have the 75% increased mining speed because why not yeah need to start up an NPC hotel and yeah I'm looking forward to this Oof, okay, I definitely need a better weapon. Luckily, I at least have a little broadsword. So I'm not sure what kind of run I should do. Um, maybe road damage or I'll probably just do another ranged playthrough. I think range would probably be easiest. <laughs> um, not that there's anything that's all that easy about Calamity. It's always just very relaxing doing the building in the day. Your first world, your first day, it's lovely. Oh, I'm in the wrong category, guys. Just hold on. Sorry, I was still on Starbound for my category on Twitch. Yeah, it's definitely not Starbound, it's more like Earthbound. Or Terranbound? I don't know. Oh, excuse me.
It's actually getting close to night time. Wish I had a net, I could capture the squirrels. And I'm really bothered that I can't finish my Starbound playthrough at the moment. I could just play single player, but then I'm worried about the files getting out of sync. I could copy the files to the server, and I guess that would work. I'm not sure though. But it's a lot of effort, so. So let me know what you guys think. I normally build like a really high hotel, but maybe I should build something a little different. Like something that just goes a bit underground. Hmm. So we have the entrance on the first floor, and then we'll see how it goes. I'm actually kind of liking that idea. Oopsie, I'm sorry guys. Keep clicking out of bounds. Ugh, excuse me. Ah, oh, then I double jump. <laughs> Done. Then I've dash. Oh, so painful. Also, if you guys are watching this, just let me know if you guys would prefer. Um, let me know what game you'd like to see me play. If there's anything, I'm thinking of doing a Witcher run, like Witcher one, two, and three. Um, Wasteland, um, Kenshi, love Kenshi, I wouldn't mind playing that again. The only problem with Kenshi is that it's a bit unstable. I'm really looking forward to Kenshi too. Oh, also, Rimworld, I'm also up for that. Um... Yeah, got Amnesia, never played Amnesia, I hear it's really scary, not that many things really scare me, <laughs> not to brag, but I mean, I'm just, yeah, I generally don't get scared, like, I'll get a fright sometimes, but, yeah, I don't know. The scariest game I played is The Suffering, like, ages ago when I was a child. With the sane asylum and whatever. That game freaked me out. Like a lot of horror games just really aren't all that scary nowadays. Or maybe I'm just too jaded. Could be either. Um, Factorio is something I also wouldn't mind playing. As long as it's, on, as it's on Steam or GOG, I can play it. Oh crap, but then it's getting dark. I don't even have a frame yet. Just eat a mushroom. What the hell that's gonna do? Okay, let's build our quick roof. Sorry guys, I'm getting a call. Can you just please hold on a sec?
Sorry about that, guys. So, yeah, I've got a nice little hole here. I don't know where I got my torches from, but I'm glad I have them. Yeah, so I'm liking the idea of an underground base more and more, even though... Well, the only problem is just the mining or the ground to actually build it. It's going to just take a while. So maybe I shouldn't do it? I don't know, we'll see. Okay, that's this area. Uh, where's my... Second slot, okay. Oh, I don't even have a hook, man. Oh, no running boots. <laughs> oh, man. So painful. Yeah, I'm not like the best builder, so I always just build like square houses and stuff because they're functional. Okay. Awesome. I don't know why I made this area so big. But here we are. Oh yeah, I've got the magic storage mod as well, so yeah, that's why I'm questioning why I made this area so big. But, I can always make it smaller. Start building a few houses. I like to get my houses done first, because that way I can get all my NPCs in. I can't remember what the minimum size is for a house though. Um, Cause I'm probably gonna make them quite small. Is this big enough? And three platforms. Uh, let's see. Housing. This room is missing a wall. Oh, so it's big enough. Nice. Okay. So let's fix that. I hope these NPCs are claustrophobic. That way we can have fun making them suffer. Now we just need a table and chair. Well. Yeah, 
There we go. Nice and little homely cave, right? <sighs> so this survived our first night, it's a good sign. I'm actually quite surprised I haven't died yet, to be honest. Squirrel, stop running into my axe. Idiot. Suicidal squirrel. I can't wait to get a better pickaxe. You know another game I wouldn't mind playing is Stardew Valley. I still haven't played for the 1.4 update. <sighs> so many things I need to do and play. Okay, let's see. Uh, I think for now I should just mine wood while it's daytime. Probably the best choice. Now deal the building at night. Hopefully we can find an excavator or something. If you have, if you know what an ex excavator is, then it's a really cool drill. You can find to mount. You just mine through horizontally. Because I like my worlds to be straight. So yeah, just so it's easy to make arenas and get around and not bump into things. So the boss battles get really intense. I'm sure many of you know this. I mean, yeah, Calamity is probably one of the more popular mods, if not one of the most popular mods. I absolutely adore it. I'm hoping. Oh, I chose crimson for this world, um, because why not? <laughs> and I just hope it's not near the jungle. If it is, oh well. You no, know, I just buy blocks and stuff to make an artificial jungle. Okay. So the mod I'm least familiar with is Thorium. So there's a, actually a convergence mod uh, for Thorium and Calamity. Ah, bugger off. And basically, you just it combines the mods somehow. I don't know how, but it does. So we'll see how that goes. I'm hoping it goes well. The story is also a popular mod. Yeah, so my Starbound playthrough, I'm also thinking maybe I'll just change to single player. 
and I'll leave the server up for everyone else who wants to play on it and do my own thing. Which kind of sucks, but I might have to. Because of how slow that server is. Um, yeah. It's not ideal. Let me know what you guys think. In the end, I just want to entertain people and play games. Yeah, it's good combo. Although me entertaining people is very debatable whether people get entertained or not. I'm lacking the idea for the base so far. I'll probably build some traps around here. Yeah, I'll probably build a, another floor above, above ground. For activating traps and stuff, or it might just be like a kind of um, what's the word I'm looking for? Like just like a little entry place. I wonder if there's like conveyor belts or something. I don't think so. Um, and problem with my base if I usually add build traps around here but if I have monsters in the middle here it's gonna make it very hard for me to actually get them in the right area <sighs> I'm gonna have to think about that because I don't think there are any blocks that move mobs uh, at least not that I know of Yeah, then it might be a better idea for me to move above ground. Hmm. Let's see, treadmill maybe. Okay. Moves. Conveyor. Ah. Oh, Pinky. I'm killing Pinky slowly but surely. <laughs> 